One of the problem I have is that I do not know the actual uh, antenna output. And uh, there's several ways to do that. And uh, the, the, the correct way is to buy a watts meter. And the watts meter will show me the uh, SWR plus the uh, power output. But it's kind of expensive. And uh, the regular and uh, OK quality uh, one costs $120 or $150, but uh, the good one costs $300, $500. And it's not used very often. So um, so I try to bypass the watts meter. One way to do that is to see the power draw. This is the power source. You can see the input voltage is at 13.8 volts and the current is uh, right now is 1 amps um, you can from here you can see how much current it draws uh, I know that it's 100 uh, watt output uh, is drawing 12 amps so 12 amps times 13.8 it's around 150 watts draw so 150 watts uh, input and 100 watts output it's almost right, but still I do not know exactly uh, how much antenna output. Um, checking the internet, uh, somebody mentioned there's a way to do it using the uh, multimeter. The theory behind that is that uh, uh, when the wave is oscillating in the antenna, it's like AC wave. So, uh, so the the power of uh, this AC wave E is uh, equal to the voltage uh, square divided by the uh, impedance. The impedance is we know is 50. I mean, I'm sure this antenna is 50. So then you can see the volts. So by theory, if I'm shooting 20 volts, uh, watts out, um, the voltage on the antenna should be 13.6. At uh, 50 watts, it should be 50, 100 watts output is 22. Let's check if this is correct. Here's the setup. This is the my antenna. This is the Incom AH4 uh, antenna tuner. The antenna is the black wire in, and uh, another is the red wire. So the red wire and the black wire is the antenna. So I put the voltmeter the multimeter one clip here on um, the red wire and another is on the black wire and uh, this wire is going to this multimeter and the multimeter is set at uh, uh, measuring the uh, this uh, bus uh, AC mode in the AC mode and for the radio, first I make sure it's tuned correctly, so it's uh, 50 ohms. Okay, it is correct. And I'm shooting the CW, it's a pure sine wave, uh, pure tone. And uh, for the power, the radio is 20%, means 20 watts. So nice 20 watts testing. Let's see what it reads. Okay. Transmitting 14.7 uh, milliwatts. Okay, so it is uh, thirteen point seven milliwatts. It's way way off. It's uh, we're talking about one thousand um two thousand one two thousand to three thousand times. Uh, uh, less. Let's transmit the next one, 50 watts. Okay, 50 watts. Let's do it. See what's the multimeter read. Let's go. It's 14.8. Uh, so it's 13.8. And uh, now do the 10 watts. Okay, 
Okay, this is a 10 watt setting. Let's see what's the reading. This is 13.8, 13.7. So it's 13.8. So from here you can see the AC voltage is almost not there. Uh, uh, I mean, or not detectable from the multimeter. Uh, the suggestion from the internet is, is, is entirely wrong. Uh, there's no way you can use a multimeter to measure the uh, power output by this way, by tapping to the two antennas. Um, well, that concludes uh, this demo, and uh, it means that I have to buy a uh, voltmeter. Well, another expansion. Bye-bye.